Hey folks, it's me, Michael Bach, your Diversity Dude, and this is Monday Morning Musings. So Maxime Bernier, the leader of the People's Party of Canada, or the PP Party as I like to call them, has uh, effectively stuck his entire head up his ass. So as you'll see from the links in the articles down below, uh, Monsieur Bernier has come out and said that if elected um, government in Canada, that they would limit the number of immigrants to the country to between 100,000 and 150,000 per year. Now, he made all sorts of ludicrous claims about how much we are subsidizing immigrants to this country, yada, yada, yada. I'm not going to repeat any of it. There's a really great article, uh, again, from CBC, the link below, that debunks all of his arguments. Um, but I want to talk about a couple of things. First off, Monsieur Bernier, uh, Canada is a country of immigrants. We've always been a country of immigrants since colonization, and let's be very clear, that's all I'm talking about. 95% of the people that live in Canada are from somewhere else, meaning they're not indigenous to this land. So you, Monsieur Bernier, with your French name, are an immigrant, or at least you're a descendant of immigrants. And it's important that we remember that because if we somehow think that we're better than other immigrants, we start to look down on them. My family has been on the shores of this continent uh, for hundreds of years, long before, in fact, Confederation, um, 152 years ago. But I'm still an immigrant. I'm descendant of uh, my forefathers and mothers from Britain, from the all of the countries in the UK. I'm not saying that I'm not Canadian. I'm proudly Canadian but I'm also not better than any immigrant that arrives on our shores today. The other thing that we need to pay attention to is the reason why we need our immigration numbers to be so high. It's not because we're really nice. It's not because we're just good people. No, that's not the point. Yes, we take our share of refugees and I'm very proud of that. Yes, we have a policy around family reunification, which frankly, um, let's just separate you from your family and see how you do. Anyway, the point is we are in population decline. Canada's birth rate as of 2016 was 1.6. That means for every woman of childbearing years, you figure that out, uh, but for every woman of childbearing years, they're making 1.6 babies. That is down from our baby boomer generation of the 1950s and 60s when the birth rate was 4.0. Now, in order to maintain our population, and what I mean by that is one in, one out, we need a birth rate of 2.1. We are in what's called population decline. You can Google it, it's a thing. What that means is we have more people who are living longer than we do who are being born. We got more older people and less younger people, which means the balance is switching. It's not a good thing. It means we're not going to have enough people to do the jobs that we currently have, let alone jobs that we're trying to create in order to grow as a country. The reason why we have immigration numbers of 300 plus thousand is because we need that population in order to supplement the number of people who are dying. It's basic math. And if you as a politician, Monsieur Bernier, do not understand that, then I don't want you as my prime minister. Think about it. That's it. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate you uh, watching my Monday morning musings, my rantings. Uh, please do subscribe to my channel by clicking on the link and uh, you can get all of your Monday morning musings on Monday mornings or occasionally Tuesday when I forget to do them. Uh, also remember to connect with me on my other social media channels. I am at Diversity Dude MB. Uh, I hope you have a fantabulous week, and I will see you next week for another episode of Monday Morning Musings. Bye.